Hey guys, it's Taylor, and today I'm going to be doing my iPhone 5 case collection video. And I really love watching these videos, and I know my friends do too because they watch them and then go on Amazon and buy the c cases that whoever has. So I thought I'd just show mine, and I keep my phone cases in this Victoria's Secret bag. And I've literally bought two things from Victoria's Secret, and one is a phone case, and then the other one is a lip gloss because I don't have money to go spend on Victoria's Secret and pink things. So, yeah. So the first case I have is this Real Akuma fluffy bear case and I love it because it's like it's like a teddy bear and if you're sad you can just cuddle with it and it's really dirty because I use it a lot and I need to wash it and the last time I used it I went to the gym with it and this guy kept walking past me and like looking at my lap because I had my phone in my lap and he was just like, I'm sorry, I don't mean to be rude, but what the heck is that thing? And I was like, it's a phone case. And he was just like, oh my gosh, I can't believe my daughter hasn't asked for that. And I said, okay. And then I put my headphones back in because, like, don't talk to me. I'm trying to, you know, do the workout thing. So then my second case is my life proof case. And I keep the box of everything because I have a problem. And so I just have the pink bumper life proof case that doesn't have the screen over it. It has the suction and this case is really difficult to use when I have my nails done because I can't do that and I'm afraid my nails are going to break and it's just not, it doesn't make me happy because I like using my case. Um, the other cases I have, I have a pink bumper, like a baby pink bumper, and it's really dirty because I use it a lot because it looks really nice on my iPhone. And then I have another pink bumper, and it's more of a neon -y pink bumper. Pink bumper. Okay. <laughs> and then I have a turquoise bluey color one. And then I have... A purple bumper that I put an apple sticker on because I wanted an apple sticker on a phone case but this is the only one I don't like because I'm not a big fan of this color purple and it's just yeah it's not that great I have a magenta colored phone bumper case it looks a lot more neon pink on the camera but it's actually like a magenta color and then I have this phone case, which I got off of Amazon, and it says, when you're at your lowest, look to the highest, and it's just a picture of clouds and, like, a sunset back here. And it makes me sad that it's cut off right here, like, they didn't really plan it that well, but I still like this phone case because it's inspirational. And then I have this phone case, and it's just one of those, like, it comes off at the bottom, and it's actually broken right there, so it isn't that protective anymore because it just kind of slides off. But, like, this is my first phone case. I got it at the Verizon store when I got my iPhone in January, I think. And so, like, I like it. Oh my gosh, it's actually broken down here, too. That makes me sad. Okay. And then I have this panda bear case. I think I got it at, like, Big Lots or Family Dollar or one of those weird, cheaper stores. And it was on sale, so I got it. And it was $2.00. And it's really not that great because when I put my phone in it, it like covers up the back camera and that makes me sad and it leaves that white glow and it's just not good. And then I have this Too Faced, if it will focus, I have this Too Faced can phone case thing. And my cousin actually gave it to me last Christmas, and it was with the Too Faced palettes they were having, and it was just like, I don't have an iPhone right now, but thanks for the makeup. And he was really upset that I didn't have an iPhone at the time because it's like, I thought you did when I had an iPhone 5, but it wasn't in service. It was like I was using it as an iPod at the time. I actually had an Android. But now I have an iPhone and I use it all the time. It's actually broken because it was just sitting in my makeup drawer for the longest time. And it actually is like slightly bent in like right here. So it doesn't protect my phone at all anymore. And then I have this one. 
and it has a little triangle and like some clouds and it says on the sky and I think I got this one off eBay for like a dollar and like I had to wait like 18 years for it but it's cute so I, I got it and then I have this Victoria's Secret pink phone case and this is the phone case that I got and I like it it's just not that great to use because it's like not it's like protective but it's also so my phone like slips out of it like my phone's slightly too small or something and then I have this case and yes it's like super spiky and like I honestly don't know why I bought it but I like it and like this one broke off which I'm not really upset about because that one was like really hard to hold because I hold my phone like this obviously like every other human and there's a poke into my hand and I don't know how it came off I think my friend Lindsay was using it or like Ashley or one of them but yeah but I got this one and I think I got it off Born Pretty and then I have this one, it says don't quit your daydream and I got this at Forever 21. I think it was like six dollars because it's on sale and I really like it. It's just it's one of those inspirational phone cases and it makes me happy. So this other one, it says good vibes and it's a picture at the beach and the sunset and all that pretty stuff and it just makes me happy to have on my phone. This one says paradise, and it's also a picture of a beach, but during the day, and yeah. And then I have this one, it's a penguin with a bow tie on it, and my friend knows I love penguins, and when she went to SeaWorld, she got me this, and I love her every day for that. And then I got this phone case, it's like transparent and then it fades down to this green color and my friend actually got this for me at Target when we were there and it just I love it on my phone it looks really nice and then I have this Doctor Who phone case and I don't think this is okay it's focus and it says people assume that that time is a strict progression of cause to effect, but actually, from a non-linear, non-subjective viewpoint, it's more like a big ball of wibbly wobbly timey wimey stuff. And that just makes me laugh because it's really hard to say, but I love Doctor Who and it makes me so upset that the last two doctors did not make me happy. Like, they just weren't good to me. And it, like, after David Tennant was not the doctor anymore, I was just done. And that makes me sad. And then I have this phone case and everyone asks me if it's like there's two pieces to it and like someone else has the other side of the heart and I'm just like nope loner. No I'm just kidding. <laughs> but um this phone case I got off Born Pretty and I'm sure you could order two of them like one with the opposite but I'm not gonna spend two dollars on two phone cases that are the same, just opposite, because the only one of my friends has an iPhone. And yeah. And then my last, no, I lied. Okay, <laughs> I have this one. I got it for free off Born Pretty in like a iPhone like accessory box or whatever I got for like $3. And it came with this, um, a pair of headphones, and I think a stylus, and this is the only thing that really worked, even though I really don't like it that much. I don't really like the color orange, but I really think these flowers remind me of like Hawaii almost, and that just, I don't know. I think that's, that's cool. So then I have my power bank charger, which I got off Amazon for like $12 because I'm not gonna spend 80 on one of the Mophie cases even though I want one because this one is not that great but you just charge it when you want to use it you just press this little button and it's actually on has a full charge right now which is great and I don't I didn't realize it did which is really helpful but you just take this off and yeah and I think that's all of my iPhone cases. So thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe down there. Bye.
elevator right up to the rooftop.